Elix is a schizophrenic game in that parts are superb like the wonderfully detailed handcrafted environments while others are frustratingly clunky like the horribly unresponsive combat controls. There is a perceptible pause with almost every melee action. The story is set on the post-apocalyptic world of Magellan, a space-age society driven to the brink of extinction by a comet hit which brought along with it Elix. Elix is an alien element which not only has corrupted the natural order of the planet itself, but living creatures as well, with varying degrees of effects. Each clan on Magellan has a differing view of Elix. The Albs consume it for physical enhancement. The Clerics use it to power remnant technology, and the Berserkers transform it to reclaim nature. The gameplay and story at the point of this review being made feels a lot like Skyrim, with plot devices taken from Command and Conquer, which is a really cool premise, but as outlined previously, falls flat due to the mechanics. Plus, Elix offers little direction and my character was continually underpowered while going on quests and the progression to level new abilities is made all the harder by having to find trainers without any visual marker for the trainer until after you have already encountered them. Additionally, I experienced clipping problems and on-screen bugs where the graphics for my control options were missing, requiring a restart from a saved game. I hope developer Piranha Bytes pushes out a fix for these problems as Elix is an intriguing game that I wanted to play all the way through. Unfortunately, for all the issues Elix currently has, I give it 6 out of 10. Elix is developed by Piranha Bytes and published by THQ Nordic. Elix was played on an Xbox One and a review code was provided for this report. And until next review, play like a rogue.